service announcement. <laughs> this is a public service announcement for you. <laughs> Starting with line number one. Is it too much to ask that you turn off your texting? <laughs> too much to ask, too much fuss. Will the world stop revolving if you're not connecting? How about connecting with us? Is it too much to ask that you use your turn signal to let someone know if you're turning or not? Is it too much to ask that you don't honk your horn when it's obvious the traffic has stopped? Is it too much to ask to be gracious? Is politeness a thing of the past? Is it too much to ask to be warm and kind-hearted? Is it too much to ask? That's your part, try it. Is it too much to ask? Is it too much to ask to have safe drinking water or clean air to breathe every day? When we're taking a walk, is it too much to ask that we don't have to walk the same way? Is it too much to ask to be quiet and listen? Is it too much to ask to be heard? Is it too much to ask to allow an opinion that isn't the same one as yours? Is it too, too much to ask to be rich? Is politeness a thing of the past? Is it too much to ask to be warm and kind hearted? Here we go! Is it too much to ask that you sit there and listen to long-winded songwriting nerds? <laughs> Is it too much to ask to have instruments only or songs without so many words? Now these next two lines, Ann and I co-wrote this song about three years ago as we were driving around Michigan. We were on a little tour and we heard the news of the tap water in Flint come across the radio. You probably heard about that all the way up here. And it, it, it triggered dominoes of complaints for two, the next two hours. And by the time we got to the West Bloomfield Public Library, uh, we had written this song. And we, to our great delight, the people at the West Bloomfield Public Library had postered the entire library with heralding the arrival of Ann Hills and David Roth with these huge, really nice, full-colored posters. Ann Hills and David Roth. And the pictures on the poster were not us. <laughs> in case you were wondering if there's humility in folk music, I took this home to my wife, Trisha, and she said she was really insulted. I can't believe it. You've been doing this for like 25 years full-time, now 31. I can't, what, what an insult to you. And I said, this is one of the greatest possessions I've ever come across. <laughs> It's hanging in my office at the headquarters of David, the Ann Hills and David Ross. You should see it. From a parallel dimension. It looks nothing like it. So I only stopped before the last verse because the next two lines in this co-write were written by Ann, and Ann alone, I had nothing to do with them but to respond with the two lines that followed. And they were good you lines. Your, your lines were good, too. <laughs> Is it too much to ask if you're walking the poodle? If Fifi goes poo-poo, you clean up the mess. <laughs> Is it too much to ask that you put on that suit tonight? Baby, I'll put on the dress. Is it too much to ask to be gracious? Is politeness a thing of the past? Is it too much to ask to be warm and kind-hearted? Is it too much to ask? Look at that. I am. Is it too much to ask? Ask your neighbor. Is it too much to ask? Is it too much to ask?